of the second season. Welcome back guys. This is Vivian and this is Bay Silent. First of all, we really hope you liked our promo video with all the radio staff. We hope we made you laugh. Thanks again to all the DJs and the dancers that took part in it. 50,000 views in five days. If you haven't seen it, you can also find it on our YouTube and on our homepage, baysilent.fm. Many new shows starting this month on our radio, particularly the Comanche and Overtech show by Coppa and Jay Overtech and the Disciple Records show. First episode mixed by Dodge and Fusky. So what's fresh in stores for this week and what's coming the next one? Well, we must start with a living legend. Finally, it's out. No need to say more. Atlantic Records, Andy C and Fiora, Heartbeat Loud. Masterpiece, another charge assault on your ears. The Colors EP by Mind Vortex will be released via Run Records next week. And you better pre order it now. Second outing on MTA for Mop Tactics with a gorgeous double A side single Gas for Breath and Watch the Beat. Out next Monday, here is a little preview. November 24th really is a favorite day, apparently. Add to your wish list also the debut solo release on Met School for the label's freshest recruit, Anayo. Magic EP called Losing My Mind. Minds called in 15 of their favorite producers to rework their marvelous debut album Mountains. It was a hard choice to pick just one, but here is Neon Light's remix of Drama out next Monday on Sparehead Records. <laughs> EP for Conquer Dawn on his own label, Uprising, with a back catalogue including names like Pendulum, Cam and Crooked, State of Mind and Prolix. Here's the title track for you. This one is out today, I promise you don't have to wait for this. Out on Collide System Shock Recordings by veteran Dan Miracle. Kinky bitch. Kinky bitch. Multi award winning DJ and producer, acclaimed in the UK, adored in Australia, admired in North America. Ladies and gents, Crafty Cut and his new single, Dope to Drop, out next Monday on Instant Vibes. <laughs> Music is a label founded in 2010, now making the transition from a digital to physical label. And here's their debut vinyl release. Congrats, guys! Two tracks, two flavors Spaghetti Western and You by Fernie. Remember when we spoke about the solar roadways in the US during our Bay Silent News before summer? Well, here's another great and ambitious project. The Netherlands TNO Research Institute has just designed and installed the world's first solar cycle path near Amsterdam. 
funded mostly by the local authority, the road is made up of rows of crystalline silicon solar cells encased within concrete and covered with a translucent layer of tempered glass. This is something I definitely want to try myself. Remote free strap in smart electric skates that you simply strap over your shoes and start rolling. Each skate has two hub motors controlled by an onboard microprocessor and are powered by a lithium ion battery pack. Just use your feet to kick off. Control the skates with your feet by tilting the skates forward to accelerate and tilting back on your heel to apply the brake. Best part is you can wear them in or put them in your backpack. The app connects you to other skaters and play interactive games. There are three different models, each with increasing fun time. You didn't like those? Would you prefer a motorized monocycle? There you go. This is the motorized monocycle made in the Netherlands. The wheel operates by using a centrifugal clutch on its inner steel frame to engage the larger outer flywheel that actually makes contact with the ground with a rubber tire. Another brilliant invention that I would really love to try. You know, when you need to do something but you have both hands busy, the MYO armband lets you use the electrical activity in your muscles to wirelessly control your computer, your phone and other favorite digital technologies. With the wave of your hand, it will transform how you interact with your digital world. Blood for life-saving transfusions is always needed and never quite enough. One thing that might discourage first-timers from returning is having nurses poking around their arm with a needle in order to find a vein. Not anymore. Here's a device that shows a glowing map of your veins that could make the whole process a lot easier. It works by shining near-infrared light onto your arm, which gets absorbed by the deoxygenated hemoglobin that's floating around your blood. This creates a glowing green image of your veins that nurses can use to guide where the needle goes in. Last one for today, Hardcore is a sci-fi adventure film shot from the first-person perspective. Now the actual movie is ready, it puts you in the place of the protagonist and you become him, but they need some more help from you if you like. money be spent on? Check him out on indiegogo.com. That was a very rich episode. Hope you discovered something new and something interesting. Remember to check out our radio baseisland.fm to find out all the shows and the DJs. I'll see you guys in two weeks. Ciao!